Hi friends, previous classes we attack the problem how to do the problem if they give the arbitrary function and arbitrary concept. Now few exercise problems I will do just try yourself z is equal to ax2 plus by square. What you will do? p is equal to 3ax square, 2 is equal to 3by square. Let's take and remove, we will get answer. Then z is equal to ax plus by plus a plus b whole power. Now what? p is equal to a will get, q is equal to b will get, pd is equal to what? z is equal to px plus qy plus p plus q by whole power 1 by 3. ax plus by plus a by b minus b. This I will do. Similarly, same story. Differentiate with respect. Text differentiate with respect. P is equal to A. Q is equal to B. So, Z is equal to P X plus Q Y. A P by Q minus Q you will get. Getting or not. There also some beautiful problems are there. Z is equal to A log B Y minus 1 by 1 minus X. This is very, very dangerous sum. Why? I will tell you. And another problem, 2z is equal to ax plus y whole square plus b. Why it is very dangerous problem? For previous problems you see, whatever I take the problem with the constant, some variable is there, with the ax is there, with the by is there. So, if I differentiate it, I can remove a and b nicely. But in this problem, sir, b with any variable is highly impossible. If I do differentiate with respect to x also, b won't remove. With differentiate with respect to y also, I am not able to remove the b. So, that time what you will do? In both cases, you can find a then equate. So, where this is also similar. This is how you will write. a log b plus a log y minus 1 minus so b with what? With b there is no variable. It is a very dangerous position these two are. So, seeing the problems carefully you can do. This is how you will do 2z is equal to ax plus y whole square plus b. Now, what you will get? 2p is equal to what? 2 into ax plus y into a. Correct or not? Then similarly 2q what you will get? 2 into ax plus y into 1 you will get. Getting or not? So, from this what you will do? Suppose, from this what you will do? From p by q means what? p by q is equal to a you will get. Go back and substitute any one equation, either this equation or this equation. Correct or not? Now, first you can prepare ax plus y is equal to what? p by a. Then, you can come back and substitute it from remove. So, this otherwise you can write p by q is equal to a or not. Okay, yeah. Now, p by q is equal to a means what? I will substitute it either I can substitute it here or here. So, my equation can become what? q is equal to what? a is equal to what? p by q. p by x plus y. So, q is equal to p x plus q y to q square. This is the required. So, that is why in both cases I will find here. This is also a good problem. So, similarly, um, yeah, z is equal to z is equal to a x plus log x a x plus log x x plus log y y minus x square by 2 minus x square by 2 minus b. So, this is also very dangerous problem. With the b any constant this variable is there. So, while doing the problem carefully you can do. If you do not have any variable with constant means for that constant we cannot remove highly impossible. So, we can remove how you remove, we can concentrate and where which fellow is relating with the variable. That fellow only I am attacking both sides or three times or four times I will remove that. So, simply idle name is what we cannot remove. So, carefully you can see this is the way. Then with the functions also some problems you can try.
Arbitrary functions also you can try this problems. Z is equal to x y plus f of x square plus y square. Z is equal to x plus y plus f of x y. Z is equal to f of x minus. Y. Here also you don't worry. P is equal to y plus f dash of x square plus y square into 2x similarly q then p minus q b minus x p minus q minus y can do then divide you will get answer <laughs> then So, this is also solid question. This how we will do z is equal to f of x y by z with respect to x if you do means what y is constant but x by z means what u by u method you can do. With respect to y means what treat x as but you can write f dash of x y by z then open the bracket y you can take outside x by z denominator square denominator into differentiation of numerator minus numerator into differentiation of them. There if you do differentiate with respect to x z domain means what you can write p that also you do not forget it. It is very very important just one you do not write. With respect to y means what q you can write then you can remove f dash some expression you will get p into something q into something then enough job is over. Thank you for watching this videos try this exercise if you do not get means what contact me anytime just text or message me text or whatsapp in my number I will come back to you when I am free. You can free to type text or whatsapp my message 9840045443 Dr. BP. Thank you for watching my video. Kindly subscribe our channel and give a comments. Bye. Thank you.